for the New York Times and the International Herald Tribune, this is Susie Menkes at the Haute Couture Collections in Paris. This is a season when a lot is being put in question about haute couture. Christian Lacroix is having financial problems and the number of houses doing haute couture is shrinking. But here is this young man in his 30s, passionate about couture. It all started for him with one thing. It started with a bow tie. From the bow tie, he developed first menswear, then women's wear, and now haute couture. But he's no ingenue. He is a designer who's worked with John Galliano, who's worked at Yves Saint Laurent. Alexis Mabie may be young, but he really has in his soul the essence of haute couture. Is your mission to lighten up haute couture, to make it younger, to make it good for a new generation? Oh yes, because I think couture sometimes could be, even if I love it, but it could be too much and I think we forgot the vestability of clothes and, and the real uh, relationship between the clothes and the girl who will wear it and the way they travel or live and the comfort about it. If you had to use one word to describe this new collection of yours for autumn winter, how would you describe it? It could be lazy. I love this word for the collection because uh, uh, it's, uh, it's really a question about the movement of the dress uh, it's a good mix, I think, between architecture, geometry, with very square, round, triangular, T-shape uh, clothing. And the effect is very light, um, floating, so you move with your clothes. You see very complicated effect of draped, but in fact, it's a very simple cut. And it all started with you with bow ties. How did that come about? Uh, it's, it's a funny story because uh, since my, my childhood I wear bow, bow ties. Everybody were laughing at me because it was really in France something old-fashioned, really the, the last thing to do. It was like the mistake. And, uh, and after I love this idea to, uh, to keep it in my uh, wardrobe because it's really me at the end. It's this good proportion between, uh, you know, the way you control the buckle of the ribbon, and you play with colors and proportion, it's like architecture. And you can change with this little thing, which is a note. You can do so many declinations and play with it. So uh, I love this idea to be addicts now to bow and to every season, reinvent it, uh, doing uh, like shoes with bows, bags, and put it in a, on the shoulders, inside of the linen. It's really like a, a crazy addiction. Alexi, do you think you can really, at this stage with the economy and things the way they are, build an haute couture house for Alexi Mabi? I hope. <laughs> we, uh, we try to do our best for that, because uh, if I do this today, it's not just to, uh, to, to have fun and presenting a uh, collection, because I, I love my work and I want to continue to, uh, and even to create the evolution of uh, what could be my style. I'm young, so you know I can't define totally my style. I think I would have an evolution every season, and, uh, and I'm curious to uh, to see myself what will happen. Mm -hmm.